What is up guys? Welcome to today's video. How are you guys doing? Today, we're doing a movie review, plus we're also doing another food review. Right now I'm preparing a flank steak, which is one of my favorite cuts of steak. And I'm gonna have baked potatoes, Drake's gonna have mashed potatoes, I'm gonna have a, a nice salad with it. Currently, this isn't the movie I'm reviewing, but uh, I'm currently watching the movie Cherry. Uh, it's okay, it's not. It's not like God tier, but I like it. I like it. It's okay. It's okay. Not 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 like this good, but it's, 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 it's okay. Here's Drake. What's going on? I'm j I'm starting the video. My eye just got all jacked up. Drake's eye just got all jacked up. I know. But it's almost time to start cooking steak. I was literally steak, about to ask you so. about like what's the uh, time frame looking. All right, guys. So the steak is almost finished. We're just gonna baste it, but here's like, here's what it looks like before. What do you think, Drake? I think it looks awesome. I'm sorry. And then we have smoothie. What could be better about it? Smoothie. I don't know. I feel like maybe it could do more kiwi and strawberry, almost. I feel like maybe the- Do more strawberry. Banana. Overpowering banana? Just like a little bit. Add more strawberry. Yes, we will see you. We're gonna watch School Ties, correct? Yes. All right, I think there's a video clip where we started it, but no, we didn't, we didn't even record that. Okay, well, we're gonna watch School Ties. Welcome back to Brendan Fraser week. Oh gosh. All right guys, we are back, and Drake has food now. Drake, give your give your initial reaction. We were sneaking it some. It is amazing. I, we were, I, I've eaten a good portion of it before we started recording. Um, really good. We are not vegans here. If that hurts your feelings, I'm, I'm not sorry. <laughs> How about the smoothie? Smoothie is good too. I added more strawberries and it is... Improved? Improved, yeah. Alright, so I've had steak. We were both we were both 100% uh, sneaking uh, some steak before. I haven't eaten my potatoes yet. Drake, have you eaten your potatoes yet? How's your potatoes? Right. Good as always. Just some... <laughs> Bob Evans microwave. My food was 100% prepared by me. Drake's food was 33% prepared by him. Yeah, by me. <laughs> Wait, well, you didn't I, I, I'm not. Smoothie. I, I well, I, I haven't not, had it yet. It's not, it's not food either. <laughs> well, I counted yours as it. That's why I said 33. But we're gonna watch School Ties. I know it's kind of an odd one. This will be in October just because week one is Brendan Fraser week if you haven't already figured it out. Put his face up on the screen. But, so the special thing about this week is that you guys know that we give like our, our ratings at the end of the video. Uh, this week it's out of Brendan Fraser's. Brendan Fraser. Yes. Brendan, I think it's weird because we're tying Brendan Fraser along with the Mummy week as well. We yeah. The yeah, 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 that's part of Brendan Fraser week. Well, I'm talking about 32. Oh, yeah. So it's it's all based off Brendan Fraser, though. Yes. Put his face up on the screen. Maybe we should upload the Mummy 19, the 32 one, on a Saturday. Mm. Run Saturday to Saturday, because then it's technically... A different week. Yes. Oh, that doesn't fit with the Mummy week, though. Unless we watch... Oh, no, no. We'll figure we'll it figure out. We'll figure it out. Uh, Anyways, we're going to watch the movie and eat our food. We'll see you guys after the video. Well, not after, but you guys. What is up, guys? I am befuddled of what just happened. I am surprised uh, by what I just saw. But we just watched School Ties with, honestly, a really good cast. Uh, I enjoyed it. I've seen this movie three times. Um, I, w I saw it once randomly on TV, and I enjoyed it then, and then I bought it. But the real person who we're gonna hear from is Drake, as per usual. Oh geez, that camera's on my face. Um, I mean, I actually, oddly enough, I actually am into like, politically driven movies, if that makes sense. Yes. This one, definitely, if you've seen it, know that that's the case for it. Um, and I thought it was done very well. Um, you know, I think, it, it shines a light on something that we as Americans forget, which is, you know... Treatment of Jews. Treatment of Jews and just race in general, to be honest, even though right now it's very prominent for, like, you know, the black community and whatnot. Regardless, 
it's kind of forgotten about how bad it truly was. Like, like even between like white people. Yeah, about yeah, and uh, this movie shines a very good light on what it's really like, and it's it's great. I mean, the you know you sympathize with the main character obviously, and the people who are who you're not supposed to like you don't like because they're just terrible human beings. And the one the people who portrayed those people did a really good job, and the story was done really well, but yet also simple at the same time. It wasn't anything that was off the wall crazy. It's very. It, it, this is probably could. This probably has happened in a way or two. Before we watch the movie, we actually started this, um, uh, like a week, two weeks ago. Like five minutes. Yeah, we got five minutes into it, but before we watched it, I had said the movie that this reminds me of the most is Dead Poet Society, and I still stand by that. Oh, 100%. It's the whole, you know, coming of age drama in a prep school, essentially. Yeah. Um, I don't think the... Well, I guess they did talk about, you know, the, the struggles that the legacy families have. You know, that's why Dylan did what he did in the first place was because he's one of those legacy guys. And you got, he uh... His traditions, they keep their traditions going. And then another thing you see with that is a character, I think his name was McGovern. Oh, yes. And then he has, like, a whole mental breakdown halfway through the movie. Yeah. Um, so I guess going to public school is not something we have to worry about. It's pretty easy for me to be the sixth generation Crutchfield going to <laughs> our public school system. I would highly recommend this movie, honestly. Uh, and then we get to the ratings. I give this four preppy, uh, four preppy Brendan Frasers out of five. I agree. You also give it four preppy, preppy Brendan Frasers out of, five. out of five. Wow, wow. Now we don't hand out a lot of things over over uh, the three range, like. The 2.5 to 3.5, that's that's where most of the stuff sits. And it's been a while since we've each put something in the fours, so yeah, this is definitely been, interesting. Yeah, it's been a hot minute since we've done that. So, this is Ben with uh, Brendan Fraser Week here on Dread Movie Reviews. This is Drake on Brendan Fraser Week Reviews. Yeah. I'll see you tomorrow.